Alright guys, welcome back to another video. Alright guys, so a few days ago, Lenovo released a new graphics driver, which is V2320.24.03. This added native support for integer scaling without need to edit the registry. So you don't have to edit the registry to add this feature to your system. So with integer scaling, is a feature that scales a low resolution on screen image from one pixel to four or more. It delivers a crisp pixelated look to image scale up to fit the display. What's that's basically saying? If you're playing at 800p, then you're getting a better quality because it's upscaling the image from 800 to like 600p. But in terms, that means you get a better uh, FPS as well, which is your refresh rate so this is a good feature to have because it ha helps you to get a better performance out of your system right so you could play at a low resolution and still have a boost in your performance while playing your game all right so first you got to make sure you install the new graphics driver so let me get into that and show you how to do that all right so let me show you how to download it and get it up and running if you haven't done that yet lenovo haven't released that feature where you could do everything inside space as yet that's coming soon but everything you just gotta do it manually for now but it's still not a hard process so once you download the file you should get this right here 02 slash amd gfx you open that then you gotta click on the gfx install you gotta extract all Extract. Once that's done, you go back in again. Then you gotta right click the GFX install again. Then you gotta run it as an administrator. This is very important, guys. You gotta run it as an administrator. You click more, then you run anyways. Yes. So let the command the command prompt run for a bit. It might hang for a little bit. Let us do its thing. Let's wait patiently, guys, because it's doing its thing in the background. Your screen might go black as well. So once you finish installing the driver, how you can check it, you could right click on the Windows button. You go to device manager. Once you get to device manager. You go to display and adapter. You click on the AMD Radiant Graphics. This is where you could check it to make sure everything is good. You go to drivers and then you'll see it says driver's date 11, 11, 4, 11, 7. That is the newest driver. The date sometimes is messed up, but this is it guys. If you look at driver version, you'll see 3.1024-3002. That is it. So next, you go into the AMD app. Once you get here, you go to gaming. Then you go to display. Once you get here, this is where you see the GPU upscaling. You want to make sure that's enabled. Then you're going to see integer scaling and you make sure that's enabled. How you want to check to see if this is actually working. Once you use, turn it on, you could open up the menu. You could change the resolution. Once you change it, you see like a black bar around the whole system itself on screen. That's how you know it's actually activated. So how you want to do is to do this guy. I want to make sure you're on 1600p and then in the game, you change it to like 800p, 720p or whatever it is. And then it will actually upscale it to the device screen, right? And then that would be a better performance out of your system. Because in terms, you'll see a FPS boost because you're actually playing at a lower resolution. So that's basically how it works, guys. So yeah, guys, thanks for tuning in. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think. If you've seen any boost in your performance. Because I have seen a little bit of boost in FPS depending on what game you're playing. So let me know if you like this update. And drop a comment down below. Hit that like button. Tune in for more awesome content, guys. And remember to always say health is wealth. Peace and love. I'm out. Thanks for tuning in, guys.